Welcome here everyone to use the control center. If your iPhone does not have a home button, I want you to swipe down from the far right hand side. It's not the middle, far right hand side. Swipe down and you can access the control center like that. If your iPhone has a home button, instead swipe up from the bottom. In the control center, you have these toggles here, which you can't customize but we can access them. And so if we long press on any of these toggles, it will expand the view. And so we have Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, etc. And you can tap on these toggles to turn them on or off. You can long press some of these toggles again to get a quick menu. So in the Bluetooth case, you can quickly connect your Bluetooth without opening the settings. And the same applies with the Wi-Fi. And you do have the Wi-Fi settings button if you do need to open the settings. And some other toggles, if you long press, it will just turn them on or off. And you can just tap, you can see here as well, to turn on or off. And if we long press here, we have customization options that you can play around with. These sliders, you can move up and down without long pressing. If you long press, you just get a finer view like that. And then we have here the focus modes and you can tap to switch these and the triple dots you can tap as well if you want further customization. And stuff like the flashlight, you can long press to get those fine controls. But remember with each control, not all of them will support a long press. And if the long press is not supported, it will simply turn on or off the toggle. To customize the control center, you need to add toggles to remove. Let's start by opening up the settings. And in the settings from the home page, you're going to scroll all the way down until you see here the control center. And you can see the controls. And you can tap the minus and then remove again. To remove a control, if you long press these three lines, so on long press, you can drag and drop to reposition the controls. And if you scroll down here, we have more controls and you can tap on the plus to add a control and then minus, remove to remove the control. I'd recommend you add the low power mode control and also the screen recording control and if you see anything here that is interesting to you, tap on the plus to add it. With that being said, if you would like to help support the channel, please do check the description. Bye bye.